Given this radical, we have the index n, x to the 10 is equal to x squared. Determine the value of n, answer to the nearest integer. So we're going to rewrite the radical as a fraction. Now we should know how to write as a fraction. We simply keep the inside part as this. And then when you have this whole thing under this radical sign, we divide by the actual index, which is n. So x to the 10 over n is equals to x squared. So the bases are the same. And what we have is these different exponents, which should be equal. The exponents must be equal. So we write down 10 over n is equals to 2. And once we're at this point, we can just use whatever simple algebraic techniques to solve for n. In this case, we're going to use cross multiplication. 2 is the same thing as 2 over 1. So we're going to cross multiply. This times this is 2n is equals to this times this, 10. We're going to divide both sides by 2. And the 2s cancel out. We have n is equals to, and this becomes 5.